Also a Mansfield, Ohio native, Marquis Sykes was a senior on the 2002-03 team that shared the Ohio Valley Conference regular season championship, the program's first since 1983-84. He continues to hold Moorhead State's all-time assists record with 606 by nearly 200 over fellow inductee and his cousin, Ricky Menard. Sykes tallied more than 100 assists each of his four campaigns, including the single season record of 189 in 2001 and 2. Sykes' reputation as a playmaker and floor leader have led to induction in the 2014 Moorhead State University Athletic Hall of Fame. Moorhead State is a beautiful place. It's a place where I was able to get an education, certainly under a basketball scholarship. It, it's a uh, uh, family, uh, lifelong friendships, um, and, and now certainly today, tradition. As a player, I, your focus is, is trying to win, trying to get better, uh, trying to win an Ohio Valley Conference Championship, trying to get to the NCAA Tournament. Those were more so my, my focuses, not being a Hall of Famer or any kind of individual records, any of that stuff. So. Moorhead goes for the tie or the win. No timeout for the Eagles. Sykes to the basket. Foul, oh! basket. Oh my goodness. Sykes led the league in assist to turnover ratio three consecutive years and tied the school's single season assists record with 16 in 2002-03 a third-team All-OBC selection as a junior and senior, he tallied 865 points and 165 steals in 113 career games. Basket by Marquis Sykes. Sykes with a drive, high off the glass, and he gets it to go, breaking the tie. Two minutes to play. Sykes quickly in the front court. Menard trying to get back on track. Three, and it's a foul. Can go to the line for the four-point play. The first thing that comes to mind is, is winning the OVC regular season championship 2002-2003. Uh, I, can, I can remember playing Murray State at home that night, um, packed house, um, and we were able to come out with, with the victory and made us the, the, the champions for the regular season that year. Um, that, that sticks out in my mind. Um, I do remember the game that I had 16 assists my freshman year uh, against Tennessee State. I, um, I can remember not knowing during the process of it and, and um, just kind of going out and playing, having fun and, and doing what we normally do and um, coming to the bench towards the end of the game, a few minutes left and I can't remember the assistant coach that told me, but somebody told me that I had 16 assists and that broke a record and I was, you know, surprised, but that's something that certainly sticks out. It gave me the opportunity to learn uh, a lot from a great coaching staff, Coach Macy, Coach Breed, and um, you know, the list goes on and on. Coach Lane, a lot of those guys are, are head coaches now in a, in a lot of different areas. So I learned a lot, a lot from those guys uh, on, on the basketball floor. I also learned a lot uh, just becoming a man. You know, they, they set great examples of, of how you should live. They all have wives, families, and that kind of thing. So they set great examples, and that's what I'm doing currently. Uh, so it, it, it showed me how to become a man and, and showed me how to coach and showed me how to play and showed me a lot. He is currently the junior varsity boys coach at his alma mater, Mansfield High School, as well as a respected social worker in Richland County, Ohio. Full time, I'm a social worker with uh, Richland County Children's Services. Uh, work with a lot of uh, youth and family in the Richland County, Mansfield area. Um, had some good days, had some bad days, uh, but, but certainly I feel like I, I had the opportunity to help people, so it's what I was born to do, I think. 